Hello everyone and welcome back to Nancy Drew, the Silent Spy. We are in the spy area. We are talking with Spy Master Yuen. Is it true that Revenant only allows others to act for them? Let's hope so. If not, then we're terrible at our jobs. The truth is, we think they're us. Imagine what you could do with these resources if your aim went askew. So... I have no idea what that meant. Uh, Revenants are the bad guys, so maybe the bad guys are working with us? No, 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 no. If there's somebody who's secretly working for the bad guys, that would be bad. Okay, I think that's what he's saying. What's with the insta walls in the server room? Those are literal firewalls. They're our last chance to save the servers if something goes awry. You know, in case of fire, make wall. Yeah, I, I know that. Yeah, totally. What exactly was the colony operation? The idea was simple. Manufacture a disaster. In this case, it was the release of a virus designed not to kill, but to incapacitate. Pushing the city into a state of disaster. That's stage one. What's stage two? As far as we understood, if the Glasgow cell carried out the first stage, Revenant would take over. Okay, what would they do next? They'd send in support, put the city back on its feet, and in the days that follow, seize all positions of authority under the guise of emergency action. Drive the stake in the ground, so to speak, and never give back what was taken. Colony was a bit tongue-in-cheek, operations name-wise. It wasn't about shifting a population, it was about shifting power. It was about obedience. Alright, so that's good to know. So the bad guys were deliberately trying to create a, create a disaster so they could take over. So why is the colony operation starting again? Still not sure. Here's the theory. Just like the good guys figured out Revenant existed, so did some bad guys. And maybe they thought, what if we follow the old script? Will they show up and play their part? Which is pretty cute if you think about it. Almost like a seance to conjure a ghost. Okay, so, um, Ewan went to his computer, started typing. Nothing happened on the computer screen, which I can see right here. That was... odd. Um... I still don't understand why Revenant would want to carry out an attack like this. They do not care. That does not make sense. They don't. They are playing the long game. What long game? I would kill to find out. Oh, you spies, always with your double talk and being confusing. It seems like Revenant was obsessed with getting the formula correct. Why? The formula is important. Too deadly. Obviously a problem. Revenant will not show up unless you hit the sweet spot. They're interested in using this as a test drone, not in racking up civilian casualties. Too easy to fight off, then it's just a cold. You need to knock three quarters of the city under a pile of blankets. Then you're home free. What about children, the elderly, people who are already sick? Ah, uh, you know, I don't want to think about that. Back to the formula. If the operation is running again, there is most likely a lab working on an approximation of the virus. Getting everything in place for when the proper formula is available. Once it is, how long would it take to be unleashed? Depends on a lot of factors quicker than anyone would like. If anyone can find the original scientist, or the original formula, it's a matter of time. If they find both? They'll have it ready almost instantaneously. How do I get into the glass storage case? The storage locking mechanism is half broken, and I can't get it to open unless it's all the way fixed. If you get it back online, can I give it a try? Knock yourself out. Alright, so so um, I'm trying to get access to a, a super cool um, place, you know, which has spies stuff. Let me just show you this. See you later. See you around. I don't really understand what's going on with you, and so I'm trying to get it's here. It's locked. It's locked. But this thing, I, I, I try to unlock it, but the system is online. It's locked. So it's automatically locked no matter what, which is not cool. Back to you, and... Ah, Nancy, what's up? What's up? I don't know. Oh, who is Revenant? Yeah, I probably should have asked this at the very beginning.
beginning, yeah. Who is Revenant? We do not know exactly. That's just what we're calling him. I'm seeing a pattern. That pattern is called chaos. Simply put, they're the bad guys. Less simply put? In this game of cat and mouse, we thought we were the cat. But you're the mouse. We're the mouse. They're the trap. So, they're trying to capture us? What? What does Revenant want? The crazy thing is, what they want makes sense. Do not tell anyone I said that. Not a popular opinion, I'm guessing. That one rarely gets asked to the dance. What they want is to rewrite the rules of the world. What do you mean? Imagine if you got to rewrite the rules of society. Who gets what, who leads, who follows, I bet you'd make a lot of changes. Right. But as the lesson of every sci-fi movie where robots become self-aware states, and our flaws lie our perfections. Right! Okay. Sure. How did my mom stop the attack? Your mother isolated the man who was orchestrating the attack. And of course he knew nothing and had nothing that could lead back to Revenant. All he could say was whatever he needed had a way of appearing. And the same person never visited him twice. No one knew what they were bringing him, or why. It was perfectly and alarmingly decentralized. So what exactly does Revenant want? Back in the days of mud huts and the like, some years the harvests would be light. Sometimes, when that happened, Two kings would meet and plan a war to thin their flocks. Then, no one would ever know of their failures. That is what Revenant wants. They don't want to take over the world. They want to keep it. Oh, spies. Are you the one who sent me the message to come to Scotland? No. Do you know who did? Nope. Do you know why? Yes, in fact I do. Someone thinks you have special insight into the secrets that were lost with Kate Drew. I don't. Oh, perhaps you do. How about you get caught up on the basics first before making up your mind? See you around. Goodbye. I really do not understand this spy double talk and everything. It's, it's confusing. It's confusing to me. Oh well. Uh-oh. Spooky message. It's time for a new test. Put the lines on the trash compactor at the station, and you will be rewarded. Okay, I failed my previous test, so let me see if I can solve this test. Because uh, I'm told that I get something special for following the test. Maybe I'll get a gold sticker. Yeah, I'll get like a gold star and something. Hmm trash compactor, so I cut it with my shears. Done. I guess now I just wait. Alrighty. Listen. The scientist is in hiding. The storehouse has been secured. The chemical agent is no longer a threat. I know you're recording this. I know you can pass this to my family. They need to know why I left. You have to make sure they find out. What message? So, we were rewarded with a, uh, you know, with an audio clip of Nancy's mother. Okay, so Bridget is down there, which is good, because I'm going to do something evil and nasty. I think. Yeah, you hear that music? I am going to go to Nancy- I mean, Bridget's room! So the only reason I know how to solve this puzzle is because I saw it in the preview for the game. You know, the trailer hmm. preview basically showed what to do in order to solve this challenge. It said you... well, it didn't say it, but it clearly showed Nancy writing this all the way across the... Oh, jeez. Right, spy time! Need to be quick about this. Bridget could be back at any second. You really should have sent somebody to distract Bridget, Nancy. Just saying. Just saying. 
This is straight up weird. She's tracking my movements? I think I'd better find out more before I confront her about this. Just in case I need that information, I took a picture. Hmm, is there gonna be something hidden behind a, uh, a, a thingy? Painting? Alright, let's see what Bridget's up to. Alright, cell phones. Okay, I need to use the McLorthan pattern here. Wait, how do I use the McLorthan pattern? Uh-oh, okay, um, this is definitely a puzzle. Let's, let's look at something else. Can I escape back to Nancy's area? Whoa, I can? And just nobody, nobody notices. Is that it? Wow, nobody notices, but I didn't want to go back to Nancy's room. But it's good to know we can do it.